friends welcome back um it's, not, it's really nice to see you guys i hope that you are all doing well um today i'm going to be doing a stitch fix unboxing or unwrapping rather um i already threw away the box but this is how it came so i'm going to kind of go through it with you guys and show you what kind of good stuff i got let's go check it out all right guys so I've got my stitch fix here and I've got my return envelope for whatever items that I do not want. Um, typically I don't use this because I always want everything because I think stitch fix is awesome and um, everything always fits so I'm always so happy. So I don't need that. So I'm going to open this up for you guys. This came in my box just like this. And I love how they wrap their... Um, wrap their clothing and all their accessories I love this I think it's cute so it looks like I've got some blouses so it looks like I've got five items here we'll just start with the first one and what I'll do is I'll show you guys just kind of what it looks like all alone and then I will try them on and you tell me what you think if I should keep or um, go ahead and send it back they know that I love floral and they know that I love blouses. They always list, or my stylist always listens to me. So um, I'm always really, really happy with what she sends. But um, this is a cute little simple floral blouse um, that is green. And it looks like it is a slightly a high low, maybe by the same length, but it is very flowy looking. Um, it looks very long and it doesn't look like something that'll cling to you. Um, it's got a slight v-neck here, which is super cute, and this is by 41 Hawthorne. This is a size medium, and this is a teal green. So this is really, really cute. Obviously something I can wear to the office, so I'm really, really, really happy about that. This is probably one that I think will fit really, really well. And that is piece one. And my second piece is fortune and ivy this is also a size medium and this is like this it's a beautiful navy almost royal blue but more navy and it's got this cute little button detail it is another blouse and also really really cute detail on the cuffs i think this is so cute um, it just makes it a little bit more stylish and fancy and it is also a v-neck blouse and it's got cotton material on the back just to kind of allow for a little bit more comfort. I typically don't like the blouse, um, like the cotton, like the mixture of material, but this is really nice. Um, so I think that this is something I actually will enjoy wearing, should it fit really well, which we'll see in a minute. And this is a three quarter sleeve, guys. Really, really, really cute. So that's my second piece. And my third piece, oh gosh, I love this already. You guys know I love my floral, and this is just so summer, and really early fall too, if you really wanted it to be, but this is gonna be like a really nice, beautifully woven um, light green crochet trim open front. So it's almost like a little kimono. This is size medium, and it's by Mason and Bell. Um, it's really, really pretty three quarter inch sleeve maybe a little bit longer but I love 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 the sleeves I love this um, embroidered detail that's so so pretty that stitching and it looks pretty lengthy and it's got the same detail at the end which I think is so pretty I love that and this is my style like this is what I liked I love that boutique floral look kind of a little bit um, old timey but a little boho a little bit of hippie style but I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So I'm sure this is a piece that I'll want to keep. We'll try those on. And then for my fourth piece and final, well, this is not a top. This is a dress. Wow. So this is going to be a short sleeve dress. This is the top of it, size medium. It's kind of got this navy blue and white detail going on. Kind of like geometric shapes. Or, um, like a geometric shape with lines really cool and this one's by um, French gray this is size medium it's got this bunched waist which kind of gives you a line there which is always really nice if it falls in the right spot right here and I typically like these as long as it falls 
you know, where I need it to fall. If it kind of falls above the belly button, which this one looks like it might, and that might be okay. It really just depends on how this, sometimes this part right here will fit kind of tight. And this will be right up, right above my belly button and I don't like it. So it looks like it's got more of a flare after this stitch, which is nice. Um, I was looking to see if it has pockets. It doesn't, which is fine, but I love dresses with pockets. So super, super, super cute. All right, and then for my final item, guys, I've got these lovely jeans. Oh, they're so cute, and I know I'm going to love them. I know they're going to fit really good. Size 30, which is my size. A 10-inch rise. Uh, I do like high rises. Um, it's not a problem as long as it hugs my waist because I have a, like a really, like my waist is small. So I'm a bit curvy. So as long as the back end hugs my waist in the back, um, pretty good then I'm okay with it but um, very very cute wash jeans I love these this is going to be indigo and it's by STS blue so it's kind of like a capri jean I'm not going to be very long and it's got this unfinished stitch bottom cute so you can fold these so I can't wait to try these on to see how they look maybe I'll fold them I like that or not but um, really cute, really cute. Looks like it goes into like a straight leg jean. Oh, I am excited to try these on. Their jeans always fit me so well and I just have a hard time because they're usually more than what I wanna pay for them, but uh, they fit so well that I hate to not get them because you always wanna get jeans that you know that fit, that fit the best because you know that you will always wear them and they will not sit in your closet. So sometimes it's good to go ahead and pay that money and have have a closet full of your best jeans instead of a closet full of jeans and only having one or two that are your best jeans. So anytime you find a jean that fits perfect, you buy it no matter what. All right, guys, so that's the fifth item and we're gonna go ahead and go try this stuff on. Hey guys, so these are the jeans. I really, really, really love these. Of course, they're gonna fit perfect because they always do, it gets on my nerves. But um, I like that, I like that I can order jeans without, you know, I'm trying them on obviously, but they send me the jeans that they, you know, are my size and they fit the way you think they're gonna fit, it's great. So again, these are a size 30 indigo wash. They're really, really cute. They are so stretchy, which is so awesome. You know, like I can do squats. <laughs> I mean, they are just, they fit so, so well. I love it. And um, again, they're like a crops jean, so they come right above my ankle, which is great. And, um, you know, you could fold them if you wanted to. You could have that look. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to keep these. These are so cute. I love, love, love them. And they fit. This is the back that I was talking about. Um, that I really like my jeans to kind of cave in here just because I have, um, what do you call it? Um, when you've got that dip in your tailbone right there. And a lot of times the jeans will come way out here and you know, it just, when you're curvy and you've got that going on, it's really annoying. But these sit pretty well right here and rest here, which I really, really appreciate. So yeah, 10 plus, I'm gonna keep these. Okay guys, so this is my floral blouse, super, super cute. Um, it fits and, and sits really well. Um, I really, really appreciate that. I really love that. So it is a bit of a high low, which you guys know I love my high lows. So yeah, this I love this. It sits so well. I, I thought that it was going to be a low V, but it isn't. It's a short V. I don't like real low V necks. Um, I will do a V that's like this. I just want to make sure this area is covered because when you bend over everything, just and I hate that. So this shirt fits really, really well. This is definitely something that I can wear in and out of the office. So yeah, I love it. I'm definitely gonna keep this. One. All right, guys. So this is my um, three quarter inch, or yeah, three quarter inch navy blue shirt um, that is actually fitting a lot different than I thought it would. Um, I think the difference is the cotton in the back, which is good. I mean, I like that. I like that it comes in and it doesn't just look like this wide shirt. So I appreciate why the material difference is there. I can understand why they did that. And you know, the front sits really well. It's a little smaller, I think, than I thought it would, but I mean, it's my size, it fits. Sometimes I like my shirts to be a little bit bigger, but I think this is fitting the way that it should. So I really, really do like it. I just love the detail in um, this blouse. I love when sleeves have this little detail, this little bow, this little tie. 
I think it just makes it a little bit more fancier and not so boring. And then it's got some buttons here, which is cute. And it's really comfortable. You know, I don't feel like I can't move in this shirt, which I love. Sometimes with blouses, you feel a little stiff because it's got that chiffon or that, you know, whatever that makes it a little tight. But this one is really, really cute. And I think I'm probably going to keep this one too. So yeah, 10 plus again. All right, guys. So this is the only dress that I had in my Stitch Fix box. This is so soft. Like it is, it feels like I'm not even wearing, like it's so lightweight. Um, and I really like that. And it's not a really, it feels like it might be somewhat thin, but when you're looking at it and it's on you, it doesn't really, as light as it feels, it doesn't feel like you're, like it's not that thin, but it's cute. I think I appreciate this bunch that it comes in at the back, gives me some shape and it doesn't tighten after the bunch right here, which I appreciate. It does flare out. I hate that when it's like, that after the bunch so yeah i love the waistline here and i love the v-neck style everything's covered everything fits it's not too snug at the top you can wear this with a denim jacket i'm gonna throw on the kimono to show you how that looks with this even though i wouldn't pair them together but i want you to go ahead and see the kimono in a second but yeah just get the right bra <laughs> and it's pretty cute it's hard to find, I gotta get long dresses because this makes everything come up in the back, which is typically why I like to go for high-low shirts, high-low dresses, just to kind of make sure whoop, the back is longer than the front sometimes. <laughs> but this is really, really cute. I'm loving it. And I think I will probably keep this one. Thumbs okay up. guys, this is the kimono with the embroidery at the end and at the bottoms. It's super cute. It's got this cute little slit on the side so it doesn't hug in the wrong area. And yeah, um, obviously I wouldn't probably wear these patterns together. Some people might if they're, if they're a little quirky, but I'm not gonna. I just want to show you what it looks like. Um, this could work for a longer dress, I think. I feel like this is too long for a dress this length. But um, yeah, it's really, really cute. I love the way that it sits. I love the sleeves. I love how wide they are. And again, I don't feel like I'm immobile in it. I can move. And it's just... I just really love this floral pattern and I really love this um, this color, this sage. It's like a sage green. So cute. Yeah. I think I'm probably going to keep this one too. I think I'm probably going to keep my whole box because everything was really cute as it always is. I love Stitch Fix. Hey friends. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all those outfits. I'm really, really excited about wearing those. Um, I do need to spruce up my closet a bit, so I'm excited to add those in. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed. I am probably going to get everything because it was awesome and I loved it. Um, St Stitch Fix comes with the styling card. Um, just to kind of show you how to put everything together. And again, remember that you get 20% off if you buy everything in the box, which is awesome. So you get your $20 styling fee that you already paid, plus an additional 20% off. Um, it's more cost effective, honestly, to get everything. So hopefully you do like everything and it works. But I've been nothing but happy with Stitch Fix ever since I tried them three, four years ago. So um yeah, I've always been happy. Um, everything that comes in has fit. I may have had a comment or two about adding in some things that I haven't seen, but it's never been a situation to where I received something and I didn't like it. I've truly liked everything that they've sent. So my stylists that I've had and the stylists that I have today have been excellent. And um, you refer a friend, I think you get $25 also. So that could be an additional on top of the 25% or the 20%. But other than that, no matter what, you get your styling fee of $20 to $5 subtracted from the total. No matter what you get. $20. No matter what you get. So, yeah, try them out, guys. Stitch Fix is awesome. Um, I know they've got Trunk Club. They've got some others. I've just been watching, um, rocking with Stitch Fix because they've always worked and I haven't had a reason to stop. Um, and I'm happy with getting five items. I really don't need to have more, you know. So I've been good with them. Anyway, guys, I hope that you enjoyed the video. I know I haven't seen you in such a long time, and it's so nice to see you guys. I hope you're doing well um, during this pandemic. And, um, yeah, thank you so much. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And if you are my friend, um, welcome back. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.